Hey everybody, how's it going? This is Justin, otherwise known as the Flipping Accountant, and today we are doing tons and tons of Walmart clearance shopping. So I am at a couple stores that I've never been to before in a different part of the state, and we're looking for toys, we're looking for clearance, video games, anything we can buy and sell on Amazon or eBay. And we just got into this store, and this store, I, are, I can already tell, this is going to be phenomenal. So. There, there's a, a ton, there's a whole row of clearance stuff. So I can already tell this is going to be a great haul. So stick with me if you guys want to see what we find. Let's jump right into it. Look at this beautiful setup here. It's almost like they knew I was coming and they wanted to have it ready for me. So let's see, we've got Mega Blocks down there. We've got Hello Kitty. We've got the amazing, wonderful dots that everyone knows how much I love. We've got Harry Potter Lego for 15, normally 24. This is normally a $30 set. Those are gonna have to come home with me. We've got Care Bears. We've got Lego Ninjago for half off. We've got Lego Thanos right here. Six bucks, that's actually not a bad deal because this is uh, selling for like 15 to 20 on Amazon right now. So this store, I'm also gonna have to go hit the normal toy aisle to see what they have. But let's see. This is, see it's selling for 15 bucks. So if I wanted to, I could sell this right now and make like three, four bucks, or I could hold on to it and sell it during Q4 or later in the year. So we're gonna have to grab some of those as well. Blippy, I don't know if those are too good. We've got Super Mario stuff. Looks like it was 12, it's down to nine. We've got a couple different versions. I'm a big fan of the Super Mario, this guy right here, the Thwomp. Overall, the Super Mario sets I'm not a huge fan of, but I do like the way these sets look, and for nine bucks, those are gonna be coming home with me. We've got some Lego video up here for 50%, which is okay. Um, this side looks like a lot of different fabrics and school supplies and stuff like that. So I will scan that stuff too, but I'm just super excited about sharing this with you guys. They do have some of these Lego helmets and I actually picked some of these up today in a different video. Let's see if these are any cheaper here. It looks like they are not any cheaper here. So 50 bucks is the price. I'll probably pass on these at 50 bucks a piece because that's what they're selling for. And I'd rather put my money into something else if I'm going to do a long-term hold. Ryan's Toys, Ryan's World, another Ninjago. Um, I've picked these up in a different video. This is five bucks and these normally go for like 20, 25. So I'll probably grab that too. Yeah, this is just kind of blowing me away. Polly Pocket, I don't know. Is Polly Pocket worth anything? Let's see. Let's see. So Polly Pocket is selling for 20 bucks, and it's $10, so there's only like a $2 profit. So I'll probably pass on this Polly Pocket there. But there's just tons and tons of stuff here. So, you know, if, if you're getting discouraged, if you're not finding stuff, maybe try a different area. Go to a different store you've never been to, because I've never been to this store in this particular part of the state. So I am going to spend some time scanning and going up and down and see if I can find some more discounted stuff, uh, filter cartridges. And I'm also going to load up my cart with a whole bunch of, uh, you know, good finds that we've got here. We've got some Minion stuff. I don't know. Do you guys think these are worth two bucks a piece? Oh, it's not pulling up. How about these Masters of the Universe for, for six? So kind of cool. And for six bucks, it's probably not worth it. That would be more of a long-term hold, but I don't know if I'm going to grab those for six. So, yeah, I mean, just looks like I've just got really good timing on this store right here. So I'm going to go up and down and scan stuff and oh, we get a little Lego Mario set here for 363. So anyways, I'm going to spend some time going up and down and scanning stuff. And I'll let you guys know what I find. And this is ticket talking Mazda for the biggest. That's a comma and a comma and a comma. Gotta get it, get it. And this is ticket talking Mazda for the biggest. That's a comma and a comma and a comma. Gotta get it. I'm a comma and a comma and a comma. Gotta get it, get it, get it, get it. Comma and a comma. Gotta get it, get it. And this is ticket talking Mazda for the biggest. That's a comma and a comma and a comma. Gotta get it. All 
All right, guys and gals. So I spent a little time going up and down scanning stuff, and I'm gonna show you guys what I'm grabbing, what I'm not grabbing. So so far, here is my cart. What we've got. Um, this is pretty cool. These Ghostbusters Ghost Poppers are only six bucks. I think this is normally like a $15 or $20 set. So I'm not sure if I'm going to sell these or keep those or give them away or whatever. But that's a pretty good deal for six bucks. Let's see. We're definitely grabbing the Super Mario's for nine. I'm pretty excited about those for nine. We've got a bunch of those. We're grabbing these ones for nine. That's another good pickup. We grabbed Thanos for six bucks, the hero of the Avengers movies. Also grab these Ninjagos right here. We've got the dots for eight. We've got the Harry Potters for 15. And some of the things I'm kind of on the fence about, like I, I did leave a couple. There's a couple dots or there's a dot and there's a Lego Avengers right there. Also, I'm leaving these down here because the discount's not good enough for me. These are only marked down 10 bucks. Uh, I scanned pretty much all of this stuff up here. And oh, we need to grab this too. We'll grab that too. These things are kind of cool. These are normally 10 and they're going for 247. So these are actually like a $3 profit. So I think we might grab these too. So we'll add those to the stack over there. And again, I just, you know, I went up and down and I scanned stuff. Some stuff has a really good rank, which means that it sells quick, but there's not enough profit. So if there's not enough profit, I don't want to mess with it. So leaving pretty much all of this stuff right here. Don't need water balloons. And I scanned through this stuff right here and none of this is, none of this is really worth it to me. I'm gonna pass on these guys for six. So yeah, overall, I think we're doing really good. This is a, a really good start considering we literally just walked in the store here. So I'm gonna head to the toy aisle to see what else I can find. Then we're gonna look at electronics. Maybe we'll do a, a quick once around the store, see what else we can find, and uh, we'll see what else. So anyways, thank you guys for watching. I hope you all are enjoying. If you are, make sure you hit that thumbs up button for me. Leave me a comment down below. And we'll talk to you in a little bit. Well, 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 what do we have here? Looks like we've got some more clearance that we need to look at. These guys are a little high at 30. I, I bet it's cheaper because that says 2 2 21. We've also got some bullet bills here. They've got some more toys over here. Some of these aren't marked because I know these are six. So I'm going to grab this one for six. Yeah, this is pretty cool. That's just like right in, smack dab in the middle. I guess you can't miss it. Uh, Jeff Foxworthy, no thank you. Um, let's see, I'm gonna put this down and then we'll go ahead and scan these Mario sets and see if these are marked down at all. So let's see. And the Boomer Bill is marked down to 10 bucks. That is phenomenal. This is a $30 set. So considering it's marked down to 10 bucks, that's amazing. So we're gonna have to grab those. Let's check this one right here. That's might fall we'll see this one is 24 dollars. so for 24 bucks this is only 20 percent off so we're going to pass on that one we're going to grab the boomer bills and i am going to grab one of these because i'm going to ask an employee to see if they can mark this down for me so we're going to grab one just to have them scan and check these wwe figures too And, oh, five bucks. That's pretty good for those. Let's see if it's worth it here. And this is selling for $19.74, but it doesn't have any rank, which means it hasn't sold yet. So I'm actually gonna leave this. That's a good deal for five bucks. But let's see, we've got some Barbie stuff. Let's see if Barbie's marked down at all. Okay, it doesn't look like these are marked down. Let's check this one. $17.44. So yeah, it doesn't look like these are marked down. 
So anyways, I'm going to do a quick once over on these toys real quick and I'll let you know if I find anything good. This is something you don't see every day. Looking at the video games over here, and I see a couple 3DS games down there. Unfortunately, they're still 30 bucks, so I think we're gonna pass on those, but you never know. I'm still finding 3DS games out there. Not the uh, $10 amazing deals that we already did find, but you know, we just keep looking because you never know what you're gonna find. So we did end up grabbing a whole bunch more Lego and i found a whole bunch more on a display cap and i think we're doing pretty good so we're going to keep looking see if we can't find anything else so all right so i spent a little bit of time going up and down the electronics and i'm not really seeing anything here they do have a couple electronics section but they don't really have anything worth bragging about so we do have a whole cart full of toys and lego that we just cleaned up just in the nick of time I think what I'm going to do is we're going to check brick seat real quick and see if there's anything that we missed that we need to grab. Um, some toys, a dragon for 20. I don't need that. So anyways, I'm not seeing anything else here, but overall, I think we did really good. I grabbed a whole bunch of these again. You know, these are the ones that I showed you guys that I grabbed. Um, there's still some Legos in the clearance aisle. So, you know, obviously I didn't take every single thing. I'm gonna pick this up for myself because I think they just took this off Netflix. So I need to buy that for myself. But uh, overall, I think, I think we did pretty good for this trip. So let me know if you guys have any questions. Make sure you hit that thumbs up button for me. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you thought. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And we'll talk to you later. So I reached the clearance section at this next Walmart and there was somebody scanning, which is never a good sign when you walk into a clearance aisle and there's already somebody scanning the clearance stuff. And I quickly browsed through this. I really didn't see anything special. I didn't see any good scooters. I didn't see any Lego. I didn't see any toys that were a good deal. So we're going to quickly move through this and get on down to the Lego aisle and the action figure aisle and see if we can find anything there because it's not a good start. All right, so after <laughs> we said something to keep my cart, I am now scanning for Legos up there. I don't know if we're gonna find anything good. I did just find a Thanos up here for five. There we go. So I'm gonna grab some of these. I'm gonna scan some and we'll see what we can do. All right, so overall, not doing too good on this door here. Looks like pretty much any and all of the clearance has already been cleaned out. I did find some $5 Thanos and that was it. it. Looks like everything else is just pretty much gone. So, and that's okay. Cause you know, not every store is an awesome score, has tons of good stuff. So we're going to keep looking and then we're going to get out of here. All right. Just to let you guys know, I did do a bunch of searching in the store. I didn't really find much. I just found the Thanos Lego. It looked like all the best Lego had already been cleaned out. I looked through the toys, I went to electronics, I looked up and down just about every single section of the store that I could think to look for clearance, and there really wasn't that much, so unfortunately sometimes it's just a bust. So I did end up getting, I think like 12 or 13 Thanos for 5 bucks a piece, these are selling for like 15 um, I'll sell them for 20 on Amazon when the price goes up. So basically just showing you guys for transparency that not every trip is amazing, you do have to put in work and sometimes it's just not worth it. but. You know, that's why we keep looking. Sometimes it's great, sometimes it's not. But you just got to keep putting in the effort. So anyways, hope you guys are enjoying the video. If you are, hit that thumbs up button for me. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you thought of the video. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And we'll talk to you later.